It's a hidden disease. People just don't see it. It's, you see other kids with disabilities. You don't see the diabetes. The first needle I had to do in the hospital was horrific. I did it, I then left the room and cried. Because <laughs> it's, it's not pleasant. The idea of, you know, deliberately hurting your child because you need to keep them alive, it's a hard thing to process and it's a hard thing to come to terms with. It is a life-threatening disease. You're actually treating a child with basically a, something that can kill them. You get the dose too high, you could actually kill your child. What's that number? 6.5. 6.5, well done, that's really good, isn't it? Do we get a high five for that? Yeah, we should get yeah. a high five. All parents worry about their children, but if they've got diabetes, they've got something major, additional to worry about. So they have to worry about their future, it's where they're gonna get the complications. They have to worry about them every day, about having a low blood glucose, where they might fall unconscious or have a seizure. So we've got six grams of carbs there, and we've got 11 grams there, so we want to put 17 grams in, in the device. We test him before he has dinner, we test him again at 10 o'clock. Um, quite often I'm up at one o'clock testing him, um, at times it's another four o'clock test. My biggest fear basically is you go to bed at night time thinking, you know, when I get up in the morning, is he still gonna be alive? It, it is something just pleasure in the mind. It really does. The idea Big fear. <laughs> losing the child isn't a pleasant one. No, not at any time. Such is life. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> I hate it. I hate diabetes so much. Sorry. Well, research is the only way we can solve the diabetes problem. Our ultimate goal is to make the lives of children with diabetes the same as the lives of children without diabetes. Having a cure would, would give him back the things that a normal kid can do. We, we deal with what we deal with now, but I'd love him to have the chance to have a normal childhood. Just be a kid.